Hey guys, it's Cindy. Today, taking up where I kind of left off, I looked at a couple videos trying to check my settings, and hopefully, I found a solution. So, let's see if we can get this done and not uh, take too long. I I did put this out because I didn't want any strangers <laughs> coming in to my garden. Now, I need to double check. Look at look at what that chicken did. Mm. I don't know how many times I have had to replant my melons because of evil chickens who keep escaping. I find them randomly everywhere. Okay. So I think they spawned weird places because I found them in odd temples. So, so far my frame rate is doing really well. Okay, so this was um, a thing that you found when you're exploring the mine. So, I have spent a lot of time down here mining. And if you ever play this map, one of the things that you'll find down here is dirt. That is very good. And iron. Oh, stuck on a ladder. And slimes. See? <laughs> they like it down here, though I have yet to find a swamp biome. It is desert, and I think it's, they're just, what do you call it, breeding because it's flat and open. But yeah. So as you can see, I, I mined out, and then I just started strip mining. Um, on and on and on. I should make this roof higher, but um, if you look in here, there's cobble. So this is why I got rid of my cobblestone generator, because of that very reason. I shouldn't be carrying all this wood on me. But we won't do any mining. Excuse me. Um, because this is all about the tour. But I spent hours, not hours, but <laughs> a lot of time down here finding diamonds and gold and redstone and dirt and coal are all down here. And I think a couple, some, what do you call it? bluestone. <gasps> I can't remember it. What's it called? Anyway. Lapis. My mind went blank. I love lapis and I don't know why I forgot what it was. But anyway. So look back at my house. I didn't really give you a good tour of it. But so far so good with the lagging. So there wasn't anything really inside these temples and um, because you had to collect the clay, the, all the colored clay. Oh, there's a piece up there, but I didn't really need it. Um, you kind of had to take these all apart <laughs> in there anyway. And then, then underneath, there's a multitude of things in here. All right. So you find there was some, I think, behind there. I've lost track of all the places that I found. And fabulous little creeper spawners in random places. That's always nice. Look at kitty cat. Alright, so this was one of the dungeons I found first. And then I found other ones. Okay, so these were big wells. And I went down there and I dug around. Did I find another one? I found so many, um, well, let's go down here and have a look. Because I kept hearing noises in one of these wells, and I can't remember which one it was. Apparently not this one. Alright, let's go back up. It's probably the other one. I don't know. How to get turned around easily. And then this was the other well. Yeah. And that's one way of getting falling down. So yeah, I found that when I was digging around in here. And I don't think I found anything else when I was digging. 
can't even remember all the things I found when I went through here. All right. <laughs> all right, that way, that way. Oh yeah, I discovered this room. This is where I got lava from. It was up here. And there was a... something that triggered it. And then there was chest hiding back here somewhere. And... had to go around this way. Which took you into this cool place which had, had things hiding in it as well. And you go down and you click the button and it exploded. <laughs> and yes, I clicked the button. In behind here is a creeper spawner, which I left. And in behind here, this was a killer. There was witches, there was so many things in here. And chickens, which they're in everywhere. This is where the big um, emerald creeper face was. And the chest had the horses or something in it. And then this was a stairway to nowhere. And there's a lot of those actually in around here. Some stairways to nowhere. Passages to nowhere. Passages to death. So that's this one. Yes. In behind here, there's a chest. I left some things behind. And I'm not going back there. Creepers almost killed me at the other temple. <laughs> at a creeper spawner. But it was tricky to find. And it, you have to check so many different places in here for things. And there will be something odd about a place. So you'll dig behind it and there will be a chest in there. I'm pretty sure I got all of it. I think this... I think I just... I'm gonna end up going back. Okay, that's the well. Here we go. This is the out. This had a lot of monsters in it too. As you can see, there's a leftover arrow, which will never go away, no matter how many times you go in and out. So I made quickie escapes routes. So in behind here, there was this, and then there was treasure behind it. And then the opposite direction, there was the exact same thing, except there wasn't a treasure behind it. There was creepers behind it. So it blew up. And it's a big crater now. And as far as I know, there wasn't any treasure in there. If it was, it got blown up by the creepers. I've dug around in the upstairs and haven't seen anything up there in here. You can tell there's places that I've dug from. <laughs> so yeah, there's not much left of of this temple. So let's run back. I have a feeling I've forgotten something that Tanner found, but I haven't been able to find any... Or if I have, I've forgotten that I found them. <laughs> Which is bad. I should really write stuff down to make sure that you, you know, get everything. But we'll go up and have a proper look at the house, which I started as a tree house, just like Tanner did. That's my pond, my mycelium, my gardens. Alright, so this is my bedroom. I use the door thing because I just feel it gives, it's more spacious. Um, my bookcases, I have sand products. I have... I found this chain mail. 
and the other two pieces. There's two. There's a full chainmail set that I found going through dungeons and things. All my food, uh, cobble galore. My trophies, and then upstairs. I didn't really show you around. This is my attic upper room, which has. Right, I had to make an anvil. This is the anvil from the challenge, but I made an anvil. And that's the one I placed up here so that I could um, add this power bow that somebody, uh, one of the skeletons, dropped. These are all the signs from the challenges. These are some other random things that I found in chess. Um, yeah, and I haven't found a use for them yet. Here's the 15 gold, or blocks of emerald. Um, grass blocks, um, spider eggs, cobwebs, galore, clay, um, block of coal, hay bale, which are fr also from challenges. Then you got your other challenge thingies and food galore in there. Er, er, get down, get down the ladder. Let's go have a nap. Okay, so we'll go and get rid of a couple more of those. Because my frame rate is rape. Rate. Frame. Oh. I say that and then I just drop right down to 16 from 40. Apparently going through doors is hard. Goes up to 40 and then it went down to 10. What is causing that? It was doing so well too. Well, we got one tour in. Alright, we'll take a short break. Be right back.